we will learn how to display an array in a table. The index display of a 1D array identifies the left most element visible. By default, a new array is a 1D array. The element display shows the single element the index display contains. However, we can also display the array as a table of elements by resizing the array shell. So here are the steps to create a 2D numeric array, display it in a table and use the index displays to alter the display. Add an array shell to the front panel window. An array shell includes an index display on the left, an element display on the right, and an optional label. If the controls palette is not already visible, right click the element display to display the controls palette. Add a numeric control to the array shell. Right click the index display and select add dimension from the shortcut menu to create a 2D numeric array in single element form. A single element array displays only one element. Keep both index values at 0 for now. The top index refers to rows. So the top index refers to rows and the bottom index refers to columns. Move the positioning tool over one of the four corners surrounding the element in the single element array. The positioning tool changes shape and resizing handles appear. You can use the positioning tool to resize the element display to add or subtract elements in the array. Resize the array to have two rows and three columns. We can also resize the individual element display. When we resize an element display, 
all other element resize to match the one we changed. We can use the labeling tool or the operating tool to assign values to each numeric control in the array. Assign values 1 through 3 to the first row, 4 through 6 to the second row. And so on. An index display starts at 0. We use the index display to identify the coordinates of the upper left visible element. We can manipulate the index displays the same way we operate a numeric control. Increment the row and column index controls to see how they specify a particular element in the array. The specified element always appears in the upper left element display. We can think of a 2D array as a row of columns, the upper display of the two boxes on the left is the row index and the lower display is the column index. The combined display to the right of the row and column display shows the value at the specified position. The number of indices required to locate an element, an item of data determines the dimension of an array. For example, this is a two-dimensional array. It's now a three-dimensional array. We operate an element of the array in the same manner as we operate a control or indicator of the same type. For example, we can increment or decrement a numeric control. We can Click a array of LEDs, turn it on and off by clicking on it. 